Then, ha! Ha! Oh my god damn it. Goku Day! And that being said, ha! Going Goku style! What is up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Fawn with the Little Things. We are back with another episode and I wanted to tell you Ramadan Kareem to those who are celebrating it and I hope you guys are staying safe and protected out there. I don't have gloves today. I brought alcohol instead. Just kidding guys. Don't worry. I didn't really drink that. It's not that kind of alcohol. But today is especially amazing because it's May 9th. Why is that? Why is that important? Who cares? It's May 9th. Because for those who want to learn some Japanese, you're about to. Go is Japanese for five. Ku is Japanese for nine. May 9th. And if you can pick, figure out what I just said to you, Goku. Boom. It is time to go. Goku. Today is Goku Day, May 9th. And that explains why I have nothing but Dragon Ball in front of me. Goku to be exact. Goku, 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 May 9th, May 9th. These aren't Goku, they're just Dragon Ball. <laughs> now, for those who are huge fans of the franchise like yours truly, it was a gateway drug to anime. All right. It started all the way back in my dorm when there was nothing to do because I didn't go party with the other kids. So I stayed home like a nerd and just binge watched the entire Dragon Ball series. And it was worth it because now I have very, very big knowledge base. We got Goku and his friends going on a huge adventure to save Earth again and again and again and again. And that was like everyone's best part when he saved the Earth, depending on which time. <laughs> now, as you can see, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven Dragon Ball items with me, five of which are all Goku. We have Goku, normal. They should have made like... This is the hairstyle I'm okay with. Anyway, we got Goku normal. <laughs> okay. We got Goku Super Saiyan and a Kamehameha Blast. Or pose, I should say. He's actually really nice. I like the hair. The hair is like the previous Goku we had. Just his skin is more natural here. It's not like Donald Trump orange. I'm American. I can make that joke, okay? We have Goku as a kid, who is also Super Saiyan, with the tail included. Now with this one, Little Things also has the uh, non-Super Saiyan form of him. Still as a kid, but just not Super Saiyan. And we also have the prime of his moment, prime moment of his life. Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Goku, oh, in his mighty glory. I tried finding uh, Ultra Instinct, but we didn't have that one. But I brought... A Funko Pop, because I know there's a bunch of Funko fanatics out there. I have the Super Saiyan Goku Funko Pop. Boom! Now, I don't have only figures with me today. I brought some cool things that would make your room pop or accessorize and make your appearance pop. <laughs> pop. Okay, that was dumb. I'm sorry. Cedric, don't judge me. <laughs> now, I don't know which one, which one should I start with. This one here? Okay. This is an item that I occasionally beat Cedric with. Ha ha! Because it is hot outside, okay? It is very bright and sunny. It doesn't matter if it's raining. This thing is very handy. Now, it's an umbrella. I'm not gonna open it because that's bad luck, if you believe in that. And 2020 is obviously not a great year. So I'm not gonna add fuel to that fire. It's, it's an umbrella, all right? It opens up, it's got this. Now. On to the next part. 
And this was something that Cedric actually asked me to bring and I'm very glad he did because I have with me some actual Dragon Balls. Ooh. Now these are actually glass uh, Dragon Balls. It does come with like a cool, like a, uh, it's I think it's silky cloth fabric on there to like keep them nice and, you know, scratch free. So there's that. This is actually really, really nice. I love that they included these. And if you want that to your collection, cause I know some people have like the, the devil fruits as well. So there's this. Now, for those who are huge fans of the franchise, I want you to tell me, tell us, tell little things, how you got your inspiration or how you got into Dragon Ball or how, you nerd. <laughs> I love it. Cedric has his own keychain. It's an actual Dragon Ball. Look at that. How many stars is that? Four. Four. Four star Dragon Ball. See, if you want a Dragon Ball, just hunt down Cedric, kill it. Now, for those who are huge fans of the franchise, I would like to know how you guys got into Dragon Ball. Is it your favorite Dragon Ball? Is it your favorite anime? If it's not, why not? If it is, why? I'm not saying let's start a war over this, all right? Everyone has their anime. I love Dragon Ball. It's not my favorite, but this is what got me into anime. If that's the same for you, cool, let us know. Share it, share the story of how you fell in love with Goku and who your favorite character is, because there's a whole world for him. Now, thinking about it, I'm watching this back when this came out in like elementary school, when I had to stay up late and my mom was, you know, not happy with me staying past my bedtime just to watch this. They have the show, they have the manga, they had drawing art books back in the day. I have an umbrella, guys. And the figures and the pops and the replicas. They even have video games now and clothing, which is what I'm rocking right now. Hold on, bam, this was a gift and I'm very happy for this. So if you made this and you know who I'm talking to, Thank you so much. I love this shirt. Oh my gosh. And it fits perfectly. I got this in Kuwait uh, Comic Con. I was very happy to see that. I also got a cute little pin of Goku. Where is it? Ba Bam, right there. Okay. That's the excitement about my appearance. And there is also, I really, I think I mentioned it. Uh, they have an actual game, which is actually where this is from. And I'm going to take it off because it's not my actual, not my style. Okay, that works. Or that works. Yeah, that way you can still see Goku. Got to keep my own look. Okay. There is a huge franchise, guys, of this, just this anime alone. There is Dragon Ball games, there's Xenoverse, there's Z Fighters, there's a whole bunch of, there's, Ka there's Kakarot, which is available for PC, PS4, Xbox One, and yeah, that's it. <laughs> and if you haven't played the game, I really recommend it. It's open world. It's got Goku's entire storyline. I thought that they were cutting it short on his story, but they added more with the DLC and I got really excited. So, not like I was bummed out before. I was, I loved the game, don't get me wrong. But there's a lot going on and you guys should really check it out at the little things because they have all this and a whole bunch more. I'm talking like a whole like casing shelf of it dedicated to nothing but Dragon Ball. They have a whole like, section just for Dragon Ball, where it's just the figures, the clothing, they have some nice clothing from Chumi. I see it happening, God. I adjusted it to like where it wasn't falling. You know, I'm, I'm gonna just work with this. They've even got some cool Chumi statues and clothing by Aiki, Iki. Is it Aiki or Iki? By Iki, I, I should have asked them that. Do do? That was the one thing I didn't ask. No. Okay, I just realized a big mistake. I'm trying to figure out if it's Iki or Iki or Ikai or something. I don't know, I-K-I. And I had the chance to ask both Cyril and Laurent that, and I missed my chance. I cannot believe I did that. So, I'm just gonna stick with I-K-I. They have Dragon Ball I-K-I clothing. That's about it. They have a lot of other items too, but you gotta go check out for yourself. Check it out online or in the store. Given the circumstances of everything I recommend online that way you stay safe I don't want you guys you know going out and risking your health and everything but we'd love to have you in the store don't get me wrong you're always invited but that being said that's all we've got for today check us out like subscribe and spread the news of our amazing show to your nearest friends and family be like guys I know this awesome crazy guy on YouTube he talks about the nerdiest things and you'll love it just share it
In the meantime, that's all I've got for today. Stay nerdy, stay funky, stay awesome, and most importantly, please stay safe. Bye, guys.